What's up guys? I'm Jim Ansel from the Real Deal Outdoors TV YouTube channel and this is The Juice where we break down all the new bait and tackle that's coming to shopcarls.com. Now it's been a couple of months since we've been able to do one of these for you guys but we're back and we got a great lineup of products for you this time around so let's jump right into this video and we'll have a look. All right, so the first lure we're taking a look at here is the new Yodo Worm from 10,000 Fish. This is a versatile new soft plastic from Catchco. Now this bait measures in at 4.75 inches from the head to the tip of the tickle tail. And this tail was designed, guys, for constant movement. And what that means, guys, is even with just the smallest little bit of current, the slightest twitch of the tip of the rod, you're gonna get crazy action out of this thing especially if you're using it with a drop shot or on a shaky head. Now the head of this lure is really nice and flat. That's gonna make it real easy for you guys that wanna rig this up on a Ned rig or a ball head jig. And it comes with four separate hook slots and that's gonna allow you guys to rig this up in a variety of different ways without having to worry about the hook punching through the ribs on the body. Now you can pair this up with a lot of different things. You can put this on a swim jig, you can put this on a chatter bait, you can fish this solo on a Texas rig and you can go weightless or you can put a weight on it. Doesn't matter how you rig this thing up, it's gonna work just as well, and it's gonna give you fantastic action. But I think my favorite way to fish this thing, guys, is gonna be on a spinner bait. You know, the combination of those blades flashing and that tickle tail dancing all over the place, it's gonna be absolutely deadly. All right, so the next thing that we got here on the list is some fishing line from the company Line. Now, Line's got a variety of different products in their lineup. They've got mono, they've got fluorocarbon, they've got braided line. All of them are high quality and at a price point you guys can afford. Today, we're taking a look at their fluorocarbon. Now, this stuff is gonna be perfect for y'all to flip into heavy cover without taking damage or becoming weak because fluorocarbon is actually abrasion resistant. Now, this is gonna be really important for you anglers that are out there fishing long days and heavy cover because you really don't want that line getting weak on you, especially for when you hook into a really big fish. Now, this is 100% fluorocarbon line, so what that means is it's basically gonna be invisible underwater. That's ideal for you guys that are flipping and pitching in shallower water where bass are a lot more likely to spook. Now, what's cool about this stuff is you can cast it just as easily as mono, and it'll work equally as well on spinning or bait casting setups. Now, it's really rare on the market to find line of this quality at this price point. That's gonna be especially true for you Carl's Club members because you guys are gonna save even more. And this fluorocarbon is gonna be perfect for flipping, pitching, or any kind of up close and personal fishing techniques, guys. Now, the next thing that we're taking a look at here is a new glide bait from Molex. This lure measures in at a whopping seven inches, guys. It's gonna be an absolute trophy hunter. Now, this thing comes with that great big body, but the realism of this thing is what really hopes to catch you guys your next personal best. This glide bait comes in a variety of different color patterns. There's a few different bluegill patterns out there, as well as a few different unique bait fish imitators. And it really has an eye-catching design and an aerodynamic body. And it's made to look like something that big fish have never seen before, but they're definitely definitely going to want to munch on. You know, this thing's molded in scales, it's 3D eyes and gills, and it's flashy finish all combined together to make this an awesome Mondo Hunter. And this lure is a real heavyweight, guys. It comes in at two and three quarter ounces, so you're gonna have to chuck this on a broomstick with really heavy line. Now, I suggest you use a seven foot four or bigger heavy action rod, and you're gonna wanna stick the heavier braid, like 65 pounds. That should get you right where you wanna be. All right, guys, so these are the owner offset blockheads. And they're built specially so you guys can throw your Ned Rig lures around cover. They're a perfect choice for you guys to avoid snags, especially when you're using a Ned Rig creature bait like the Ned Crawls or a Sakoshi Bug. Now with these offset blockheads, you're gonna be able to throw your Ned Rig baits around grass, around timber and laydowns, and also in lily pads. And that's gonna allow your Ned Rigging to be a lot more versatile. Now what makes these things unique is they've got an offset hook on them. So you're gonna be able to basically Texas rig your Ned Rig lures onto the jig head. And essentially you're gonna rig this up just like you would a Texas rig. You're gonna go through the head of the bait and come out with the tip of the hook. You're gonna spin that thing around and you're gonna finish by coming through the body. Now rigging the bait like this is gonna make the presentation nice and weedless, but it's also gonna allow you the room to set the hook when you get a bite. Now the weighted mushroom style head is gonna act just like any other Ned Rig jig. It's gonna allow your bait to stand straight up in the water. And that's what's gonna allow the maximum amount of action from those buoyant Ned Rig soft plastics. And if you want the best results, guys, you're gonna wanna fish this on lighter tackle. So you're gonna wanna go with a spinning setup as well as lighter line. The next thing that we're taking a look at here, guys, are some lures that have already taken the bass fishing world by storm, but we got some brand new sizes for you guys. And these are the Guggen Squad soft plastic lures. So we've now got a three inch Kraken Crawl, a 3.3 inch Bandito Bug, a 4.6 inch Trench Hog, and a 7.25 inch Mondo Worm. Now these Guggen Squad soft plastics are already some of the best soft plastics out there, but they wanted to diversify you guys' arsenal by adding these new sizes. So now it doesn't really matter where you land on the spectrum, whether you're a pond hopper or a weekend warrior, 
or a serious tournament angler, there's something in this Guggen bait lineup for you guys. These baits are all really versatile. You can rig them in a variety of different ways. You can Texas rig them, Carolina rig them, put them on chatter baits, spinner baits, buzz baits. You know, you can Texas rig the crack and crawl for a tasty little weedless option that you can punch in and out of grass mats. That smaller bandito bug would be perfect for a flipping jig or maybe dragging around on a shaky head to trigger bites. Now you could take the lizard like trench hog and you could throw that thing around docks or in river eddies. Or you can take that mondo worm and you can drop that into some really thick stuff. That's a lure that bass are going to absolutely hammer on the fall. And Carl's Club members, you guys are going to be able to get the goods in any size and color with that special pricing that Carl's offers just for you guys. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for this episode of The Juice. Hopefully, you guys got something out of this and it helped somebody out. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the Mystery Tackle Box YouTube channel. That's going to keep you guys up to date with all the new content that Mystery Tackle Box and Carl's Bait and Tackle are releasing. Also, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you head down, hit that thumbs up button, then drop down in the comment section. Leave us a comment and tell us what your favorite lure was from this episode of The Juice. Finally, if you guys really enjoyed the video, you can head over and subscribe to my YouTube channel at Real Deal Outdoors TV. We're going to drop a link for you guys right down in the description. As always, thank you all for watching and tight lines until next time.